Yo, 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 daily accountability vlog, day whatever. <laughs> All right, so I think it's been roughly three or three or three and a half months now that I've been doing this. That's exciting. <laughs> uh, I, I guess, uh, you know, it's interesting how uh, the fact that I've uh, distanced myself from the instant relief, uh, it's uh, sort of, it's revealed what I've tr sort of been reveal uh, relieving myself from, which is, I guess, uh, loneliness, which is, uh, of course, like, the physical urge, but also, like, the emotional, <laughs> the emotional portion of it which is the I guess uh, lack of intimacy that I have in my life and that's um, I guess that's been a not only a theme throughout this but a very revealing thing and I suppose uh, one thing that Jordan Peterson would say would be that uh, <laughs> it's oftentimes the male sex drive, which uh, drives them to, you know, put themselves out there and grow and succeed. And, well, maybe it's not just like the sex drive, but just um, the drive for, for intimacy, to be with someone that you can uh, pour yourself into. I suppose... You know, maybe saying the sex drive, that's that's too, like, carnal. That's too detached. It's like, it makes it more of a physical thing than, than I think it really is, which is more of a, a deep wellspring of... of purpose, I suppose, of a, I guess it's one of mankind's, uh, <laughs> one of mankind's greatest desires. It's something that is just talked about in the Bible so much because it is just so important. And I suppose, you know, of course it's not the most important thing which is obviously God, but uh, it's it's definitely. I mean, there's there's definitely a reason why God created us man and woman, and uh, because the man was lonely, and and so. Yeah, no, nothing else could really fill that that longing that he had. Not even his relationship with God could in that same way, which is interesting. Even though he was in perfect com communion with God, he was still uh, he still he couldn't find a partner amongst the animals. It was. He had to find someone of his own flesh. Sort of like rejoining that part of you that was taken however many thousands of years ago and placed into her. I'm going super crazy philosophical right now immediately. <laughs> You know, I, I never really know what I'm going to talk about whenever I, I press the record button. It's always a bit of a surprise to me, I suppose, because I'm really just venting outwards. This is my journal, effectively, where I just talk about anything that's on my mind. And so, yeah, I think I'm in a better place, but I'm still dealing with the... Um, the anger thing, 
That seems to be more of the problem now. Just any time I make a mistake, like I was noticing it yesterday as well. So I guess today when I was I was thinking to myself uh, how I how I react to other people who make mistakes, and usually I'm com compassionate and warm and try to calm and soothe, but then whenever I make a mistake, I always just like bash myself with a with a with a sledgehammer, is continually. And just get so frustrated and angry because I have to uh, redo something or like I've wasted a whole bunch of time doing something and need to uh, need to do it again. And, yeah. I suppose uh, if I treated myself with the same in the same way that I treated others, then maybe. Maybe that's one way to try to solve it. <laughs> that would give me the grace to do that. <sighs> yeah. It's interesting. Um, I, oh yeah. <laughs> I, uh, something I forgot to mention that happened somewhat recently. That, it, that exam happened. Uh, yeah, finally, that the energy advisor exam that happened on Wednesday, I passed with like a 75%, <laughs> but it's good enough, I passed. Uh, so that's, that's good, that holds me for the next three years or something like that, so I can keep working, and that's nice. I don't lose several weeks worth of income or something, something like that <laughs> uh, when I in between not having a license and trying to retake an exam or something like that. So that's very, very nice. All right, I think that's enough. Uh, I'm trying to think of anything. Well, I don't even remember what I talked about last time. <laughs> I don't even remember when I did it. I think maybe Saturday or something like that. Yeah, all right. Well, uh, we'll talk to you guys later and proverb down below.